Hey there, I'm Francisco, and today I am here to provide you with the necessary information and simple solutions. Have you come here wondering why your iOS 18 screen suddenly blacked out after you updated it? Then, no worries, as we'll go through the most common factors that cause your iOS phone screen to go black. After that, I'm going to demonstrate how to resolve the issue using multiple fixes in this video. But before that, hit the notification bell and make sure to subscribe to my channel and make sure to subscribe to our channel so you never miss any of our videos. Now, without waiting any further, let's jump into the different causes and solutions of the iOS 18 black screen after the update. Part 1. What are the common causes of black screen after a phone update? You might be wondering what actually causes the screen to go black after the latest iOS 18 update. To clarify the issue, I'll provide you with the most common causes. Incomplete update. One of the reasons for the iOS 18 black screen is the incomplete update processing of the phone. If, for some reason, your phone is interrupted during an update session, such as the low battery, weak internet, and more, it can lead to a black screen. System overload. In case you have several tasks open on your iOS device, it can get overloaded really quickly. The whole screen freezes out and goes black within seconds if you don't close all of the extra tasks operating in the background. Firmware issues. You know that your phone can malfunction due to an uninvited system failure or because it is incompatible with its firmware. Moreover, when the phone gets black, it also means the new update introduces a bug to the system. Cache problem. Another reason for your screen turning black is the accumulation of the system cache, which might corrupt the update. Also, it causes the iOS not to boot up properly and thus leading to a black screen. Malfunctioning hardware. A black screen can also occur due to various underlying hardware problems. However, it is less likely to occur, but do ensure to look out for any malfunction in your hardware. Part 2. How to fix iOS 18 black screen after update After familiarizing ourselves with the common causes of the iOS 18 black screen issue after an update, let's move forward and look at the multiple fixes. I'll show you exactly how you can fix this issue using multiple methods and steps. Method number 1. Wondershare Dr. Phone one of the most recommended iPhone repair tools that you can use is the Wondershare Dr. Phone, which can help fix the black screen issue after iOS 18 update in seconds. This repair software can securely repair any type of system error or issue your iOS 18 might be facing, which is the black screen in this case. Besides, Dr. Phone provides you with two iOS system repair modes that maximize system recovery and have a great success rate. The standard mode can fix all types of system issues quickly, such as black screen and other problems without data loss. In addition, the advanced mode does a deep scan of all the complex scenarios and helps users when the standard repair mode fails to fix the issues. Now, let me show you how Dr. Phone can instantly repair the iOS 18 black screen issue. First, download the latest version of Wondershare Dr. Phone and launch it on your computer to access its main interface. From here, click the toolbox option from the left side panel to open its available features on the right. Now choose the system repair option and connect your iOS 18 device to your computer to begin black screen repair. After connecting, choose the iPhone option under the Select Your Device Type section. Now on the screen, select iOS Repair among all the options and click the Standard Repair mode from the other screen. Moving forward, put your iOS device into recovery mode by following the on-screen instructions and hitting the Enter Recovery Mode button to download the respective firmware on your iPhone. The next window will provide you with multiple firmware options that you can download to repair your iOS 18 black screen. When the iOS firmware firmware is installed and verified, press the Repair Now button to initiate the repair process by displaying a loading screen. After thorough system repair, the last screen will show Repair Completed, where you have to hit the Done button to conclude the entire process. Method number two, force restart your iPhone. Other than trying the first method, you can also try force restarting your iPhone. This quick fix often solves minor software bugs or system problems that cause your iPhone screen to go black. Here's how you can perform this task. First, press Press and quickly release the volume up button, then press and quickly release the volume down button. Now press and hold the sleep wake button until you see the Apple logo appear. 
that's your signal that your iPhone is rebooting and to hopefully fix that black screen issue. Method number three, charge your iPhone battery. If the previously applied methods don't work, the issue could be related to your battery. Sometimes a severely drained battery can be the culprit behind the black screen. To fix this, plug your iPhone into a wall charger and let it sit for at least 30 minutes. That gives the battery time to regain enough power, and while it's charging, keep an eye on the screen. When your iPhone powers on by itself, the reason behind this issue was likely a drained battery. Method number four, restore iPhone via iTunes Finder Recovery Mode. You can try another method to restore your iPhone back to its factory reset condition for resolving this problem using iTunes or Finder. Whether you're facing issues or simply want a fresh start, we've got you covered. Before we begin, you need a few things to do. First and foremost, you need an Apple certified USB cable to connect your iPhone to your computer. Then install the latest version of iTunes slash Finder on your PC or Mac. Now let me show you each step of the process to get your iPhone running smoothly again. Connect your iPhone with black screen to your Windows PC or Mac using the Apple certified USB cable. To fix iOS 18 black screen after update, we'll need to put the iPhone into recovery mode. We're doing this press and quickly release the volume up button, then the volume down button, and finally hold the sleep wake button until the recovery mode screen appears. After putting your iOS 18 device in recovery mode, you'll see a pop up that says that your iPhone is in recovery mode. So click the restore button to let iTunes or Finder download and install the latest iOS 18 firmware on your device. Method number five, enter DFU mode. Sometimes restoring your iPhone through regular methods may not work, especially if you're stuck on a black screen and your device is unresponsive. That's where DFU mode or device firmware update mode comes in. DFU mode is a more advanced recovery method that allows your iPhone to communicate with iTunes or Finder without loading the operating system or bootloader. It can help fix major software issues, including the dreaded black screen. Begin by turning off your iPhone and connecting it to the PC or Mac via an appropriate USB cable and ensure iTunes or Finder is open. To enter DFU mode, quickly press and release the volume up button and then the volume down button. Next, hold the side button or sleep wake button until the screen goes black. Then press and hold both the side button and volume down button for five seconds. Moving forward, release the side button, but keep holding the volume down button for about 10 more seconds. Your screen should remain black, but iTunes will detect your iPhone in DFU mode. Once your device is in DFU mode, iTunes or Finder will prompt you to restore your iPhone. Click restore, and iTunes or Finder will reinstall iOS 18, potentially fixing any underlying software issues that caused the black screen. After the restoration is complete, your iPhone will restart and you can set it up like new or restore from a backup. DFU mode can be a lifesaver when standard recovery options aren't enough. Method number six, contact Apple support. If all of the discussed solutions haven't helped you in fixing the iOS 18 black screen after the update problem, it's time to reach out to Apple support. There could be a deeper hardware or software issue that needs professional attention. You can contact Apple through their support page or visit an Apple store for help. They'll be able to to diagnose and fix the problem for you. There you have it. Although dealing with an iOS 18 black screen after an update can be frustrating, this issue is fixable. I presented you with the best repair solution, Wondershare Dr. Phone, which we covered in detail in this video. Moreover, with the help of its standard mode, you can get rid of the issue without losing any data. I hope this video has answered all your unsolved questions about fixing the black screen of iOS devices. Last but not least, be sure to comment and subscribe to this channel to get similar and other help solution videos. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.